We are having way too much fun today talking about my personal favorite band, Led Zeppelin. Now, take a second and try and understand this. This is the Holy Grail. In through the outdoor, all six hand-signed covers. And there's a, there's a pretty detailed story that goes along with this, so you might want to sit down. When Zeppelin came out with In Through the Outdoor, their last album was Presence in 1976. So when they decided, after uh, they, they talked about planning and recording again, decided to go into the studio, what do they call it? Because so much had happened in the industry with the, uh, the punk rock, the Sex Pistols, the Clash, and so forth. So they came up with the best title you could, In Through the Outdoor, because that's the hardest way to get back in somewhere, In Through the Outdoor. And what they decided to do is create a New Orleans style bar scene in England. And if you'll notice, the brown here represents the way they did sound on all their albums prior to In Through the Outdoor. They created a different sound with John Paul Jones, a lot of synthesizers. The whoosh, like a bar towel, cleaned it off, it's in color, represents the new twist, the new sound, a lot of synthesizers. And what it is, which is genius, there's six people in the photo, and it is a still shot of each person staring at the gentleman at the bar. Now he's burning something. And if you will take a look, see the girl's legs right here? This is her point of view. See the bartender staring at him? That's his point of view, staring right at the person. Okay, it's a still shot. Now then, what is he burning at the, at the, uh, at the bar? He's burning a letter. And it'll make more sense in a minute because the vinyl went into the sleeve. The sleeve went into the brown paper bag. Now then, in the two years they were gone, Rolling Stone and other magazines were basically trashing them. So Peter Graff said, we're going to package it like garbage in a brown paper bag. We're going to ship it out. And we're not telling anyone which album covers in which. It was really genius because here's what they did. A, B, C, D, E, F. That's the way they titled them. A was sent to one part of the world. B was sent to another part. C to another part. And all these collectors were spending all their money trying to buy every album they could, hoping they could get all six of them, which took quite a while. And when you think about it, John Bonham died within a year of this coming out. And to obtain all six of them, signed by Bonham on them, is really, it's really an achievement. So here's what happened. Ink is embedded in this album sleeve cover. So when you take it out and you put a wet paper towel on it, it comes to life. This is the way the evening started when the gentleman was sitting at the bar. This is the way it ended, broken glass, cigarettes everywhere, ashtray full. But what was he burning at the bar? Dear Jay, it was a Dear John letter that he was burning. So, In Through the Outdoor is Led Zeppelin's very last effort in the studio. And uh, it's, it's, for us to be able to put this together, this is about a five-year project to uh, be able to obtain everything, get an authenticated design and so forth. And it's, uh, it's a huge conversation. So, enjoy Led Zeppelin, the ultimate, In Through the Outdoor.